The Kentucky Fair and Exposition Center behind me is where Louisville residents will be voting during this pandemic, but critics say one polling location is not enough. With about 60,000 people wanting to come to one location, if we're going to take COVID seriously, which we should, then that is that, that in you know that, that doesn't that's not smart. Jason Nemus conjures the images from Georgia and Wisconsin of long lines of voters, and he says a single polling location creates transportation obstacles that could be considered voter suppression. They're not likely to go to the fairgrounds because it takes too long to get there. The parking everybody knows is not right next to the to the building. And so if, if they uh, are much more likely not to vote. Nemus wants a judge to force Jefferson County to provide more voting sites before June 23rd. I think a good response would be one in every public high school. They're, they're geographically dispersed in Louisville. I think there's only 23 of them. Um, we could do that. But a spokesperson for the Jefferson County Clerk's Office says it's not that easy. If you take the size of a gym, you just don't know how many people will show up at what location. You'd have to have all six, uh, enough ballots for 611,000 people at each place. He says election officials thought the Kentucky Fair and Exposition Center was the best choice among many venues they considered. To lay out uh, 2,200 ballots and to have scanning machines uh, spread out and to be able to go through one entrance and exit out of another and still manage the social distancing, you couldn't ask for a better location for that. And he says the widespread availability of absentee ballots will likely lead to massive turnout. We have 611,000 voters here. Right now, 230,000 people have asked to get a ballot through the mail. That's more than any of the other elections. Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News.